to realize that everybody awakens multiple times during the night. When we look in the sleep laboratory, in fact, and we count the number of brief EEG arousals, and these are arousals that last at least three seconds but are less than 15 seconds, people with normal sleep actually have 10 of those per hour of sleep. So if you're sleeping for seven hours, you're going to have 70 or so transient arousals per night. Now clearly there's a difference in some individual's perception during those transient arousals or very brief awakenings, let's say that may last a minute or two. Some people may have no recollection of those and other people may be acutely aware of them. So it is important to distinguish normal sleep where we do have these brief arousals and somewhat uh, longer uh, awakenings that then may last uh, a minute or two from abnormal sleep where it is excessive. How do we distinguish normal from abnormal sleep on this basis? We don't really have any clear mechanism, but certainly if you are awakening, feeling uh, not rested in the morning, and during the day feeling the consequences of poor sleep, such as impaired concentration or attention, or in fact excessive sleepiness, this may uh, be an indication of uh, abnormal or pathological sleep and some evaluation for what is disturbing your sleep at that point uh, would be warranted.